This is the part of the game where I stare at the screen and try to remember what we were doing last time that made it start right here. <laughs> um, I think we had just set two houses over there. And we had just shut down these two pack stations because we had sent over all that we needed. So that needs to be reevaluated this time. Um, we are, well, we will eventually be bringing in a bunch of wool from these guys. We're 12. Though we're bringing in eight more, so eventually it'll be 20. Yeah. Uh, sheep, in case you don't know what, what's going on there. And we have a we have a shepherdess. Huh? In the, uh, in the field. Anyway, we will eventually be needing another tailor, I'm thinking. One that can dedicate to wool products, which I believe is the... That's not it, right there. Tailor General... Yeah, oh, it's linen and dyes. Cloaks are yarn and dyes. I kind of like this idea of cloaks. And I wonder if it will change the attire of the people walking around. We're going to start seeing a bunch, of, uh, a bunch of, of cloaks about all of a sudden. I don't know. Um, but I think at the moment... Yarn, where are you? We've got zero wool and four, four yarn. So lambs apparently don't make wool, only sheep. And these lambs are taking forever to grow up. That's why we are now in the process of bringing in sheep, not lambs, even though they're cheaper. But a dye industry would be good. Um, we're concentrating on wild animals over here. We've got just a, a typical berry deposit, which doesn't really last that long though we were bringing in berries to uh to trade for spears or what have you berries over here we still got 60 over here we ran out completely over here we're just dealing with meat now i'm thinking about because i've got two points and i'm sure there's a third one about to pop in for gimli um we need to get into the probably charcoal and basic armor uh, next, probably go down these runs. So there's four points to spend right in there. I think that's a fifth one. And I think a sixth one is right here. Might give Gimli the assignment of creating dye as one of their major, uh, um, major exports. Over here, we've got roofing tiles. Uh, is this where I think I am? It is not where am i right here samwise we've got roofing tiles going on for a major export um what do we officially call on these yeah roof tiles okay so they could be doing that and they are not doing that yet because they're still waiting for one more point over here waiting for a couple of these guys to get built level twos and <laughs> speak of the devil level threes all right so we just got there so you guys i want this Trade logistics. Establishing a new trade route costs 50% less. Done. This one cuts the tariffs in half. But I don't see us buying a lot of stuff over here. If I was going to buy anything, it would be the grains. Just to keep it coming in. But over here, we're making it. So I don't think that's a thing. But I wanted that so that I could... Where am I? Back further? No, over here got to roll myself around to find this trading post each time. I want to purchase the roofing tile route so we can get this coming in. It's only going to cost us 80 now. Oh, Gimli's at it as well. Only going to cost us 80 instead of the 160 we saw last time. Established trade route. Now we can be selling our extra trade or extra roof tiles, which in this case there's 55 sitting there ready to go. Um, we could also purchase the the uh, large shields or we could hang on to those maybe that'd be wise let's concentrate on the other two large shields take quite a bit to make as far as planks go small shields are a bigger profit joiner and these take two planks takes one takes two planks your best profit margin sitting right there until we overwhelm the uh, the market but these folks over here could be selling small shields and roofing tiles I'm thinking over here, these guys could be concentrating on berries. And actually, I'm talking instead of 
instead of doing. So I'm going to pause for a little bit because it's already February and well, berries start up in April. So if we were to spend one of Gimli's three points right here just to get us going, then that doubles the berries. So we're at, normally we're sitting at 100 or 64. Now we're at 128. Let's get a third one of these guys up and going, a forager's hut. And I'm thinking every spring we can kind of fire everybody until we have enough population and just put them into berries. Berries and filling up the granary from these to keep their, their storage, uh, their general storage emptied so that we can just keep collecting berries for the three months, April, May, June. Yeah, three months that berries are, are building like crazy. And then when we get into September, we shift everybody over to the farming area just kind of moving a uh, a migrant worker base back and forth is kind of the idea um so i want to get this started then i can turn the game back on but right there forager's hut and i see these lines right here so it's quite steep up in here too steep to build but if you turn it along you know parallel with the lines we should be able to get into here somewhere. Is there anywhere I can go and not take out a tree? Just out of curiosity. Oh, 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 there's a pixel. Okay, put you in right there. Get you built, highest priority, and turn it back on. So three forager huts up and running and a granary collecting and emptying them for three months, emptying this out, giving us plenty of berries to be able to set up a dye industry which may as well be right over here too because we've got all the ingredients are going to be right here we didn't already do that right we did in the other two but we have not if i did it would have put it right here here's the clay furnace which is temporary because we only have a certain amount of clay and i don't see any reason to continue afterward all these trees knocked down hmm so dye is going to come out of here as one of their as basically their clay tiles besides the iron industry and the armor that's also going to be a benefit to Gimli but um, over here I want to I want industry and I want dye so you're going to be over in this area too oh I didn't mean to click that I meant to rotate it but yeah that's fine you can live right there let's get rid of that snap too that just there we are don't do that to me okay so that gets built not next this is the next one. It's got to get done. There's one family to build with. We are in February. We're not over 75, so we shouldn't see another uh, family this month. Um, what was that last thing? So, Gimli, level 2, Samwise, small stables. That's right, we got two small stables over there. Uh, Burgage plots, level 1s, level 1s. Gimli's, yeah, okay. Where did we put those in Gimli? That wasn't these. <clears throat> All right, let's find that. Uh, right there, Gimli's last burgage plot. Oh, these two, and they're just finishing up another one. Okay, so if I put any more in, I need them to be out in here. Now, did we put a market out here? We did. Okay, we have a market happening. I think there's room for three in here, right? No, four, okay. And I want to get more houses out over here, more toward this area where we're going to need workers. Oh, there's so much going on. I feel like I want to slow it down even more so I can spend enough time in one city, one town, without feeling like I'm missing the other two completely. Let's throw in some more houses and where. Because I'm also thinking about, I'm thinking about too many things at once. Getting in here, getting into charcoal burning. As well, we need to get armor, basic armoring going. But charcoal is probably right in here, along with more firewood cutting. Because we have a huge forest over here that the only obstacle are these berries. So this whole area is available. So forester's huts and firewood cutters and charcoal all kind of rolls into here. As well as, probably wouldn't be a bad idea to go ahead and get a garrison tower popped into here and get that going. Commit to you. So we're going to need that one of these days. In fact, we haven't had a raid in a long time. So <clears throat> that's... That's got to be coming. Remember that episode where I said uh, we we haven't had a lightning strike yet, and and <laughs> last time I saw it, it, it hit the market, and then five minutes later, lightning hit our market. Yeah, we, we haven't had a raid in a long time, so yeah, just just forewarning there, foreshadowing maybe. Um, 
So you're going to be built. You're going to be built post haste. And I'm curious. Well, still just one family. Can I steal a family somewhere? I'm going to need to steal six or eight families here soon. So what can I do? We are we are in need of food soon. So the berries are going to help us out there. We're down to three months. Meat can only go so far. We don't have that many animals. Uh, we do have two families making meat right there. And more going on over there. Right there. That was Samwise. Yeah, so much happening out there. So I can't get any more families bringing in the only food source we have right now. So we're going to see this dwindling. Should be down two months before long till the berries come in. Where can we get more bodies? Clay Furnace is not up and running. Because Forester's Hut is not critical. I could steal from there. The Tannery? How many uh, leather? There it is. Only 10 hides. Pull the, let's shut the tannery down. Which also shuts down a stall. No, it's, it's not It's not highlighted. Okay. And Woodcutter's Lodge, we could take one family out of there. We're doing fine with firewood right now. Eventually, we'll take them. We'll leave one over here for firewood in this area. And we'll move most of them over here for firewood for our, our industry. Okay. So there's three families to start construction. I guess I could just place something so that it's building well it's houses that's what i was that's where i was working with a moment ago okay so show me emmer there was a little bleed over right here right right in there right there is that enough to justify doing something with it probably not we have a lot more to go over here and there was another pull back a little bit so it's that area left and that's it a little bit going on over here once the clay is gone that kind of works there's a little bit going on over here okay so we'll ignore that we'll go ahead and house in this area um you are a windmill under construction and that is it through this run you are a well to get done any more yep lots of well possibilities around here you are there you are I feel like there was another well that's been put in around here right there so there should be one that goes in right in this area i guess on the outside that's where it'll fit better so you're going to go in here i want to get lots of building projects set up so that when i'm forgetting about working in gimli they can still be doing something so you're going to go there and let's put in some housing and i'm thinking it's like from here over pull down a little there we go um how many a little further up, like so. Does that give us backyards? It doesn't. A little higher up. We can do that. Hmm. I like interesting shapes. Let's consider roading this area first. Charcoal can go up, be made, and brought back. It's not needed for dyes. It's not needed for this. It's not needed for that. There's nothing out here that needs it. Even over here. So firewood and charcoal and fuel, if it's going to be anywhere, it's probably going to be up in this area. So it's mostly just, I guess, to head to the pack stations or to the trading posts. That could be, in fact, we could trade post, our second trading post, since I want two in each town now, could be over here. Near this system. And what are you guys all doing? Oh, you want, you're hauling stone. Okay, that's why you're so busy. Hmm. So I think... I like this fork in the road. Let's throw another fork from here. Up like this. And up into... Along the contour line. Okay. That looks pretty good. And we can kind of work in and around that. So I think up above this will be industrial. And down below this could be homes. So let's go that route. And grab from here around the curve. Let's set this up kind of like that. Okay, and minus it a while. That gives us doubles all the way around. Kind of like that. Let's go that route. Nice big spacious areas in this big spacious area. Yeah, it kind of feels better than cramming a bunch of them all tied.
tight together. All right, so we are out of Gimli for a while, I think. They have three families to, to do all that. What is going on over here? We did buy the... I feel lost now. There we are. We did buy the one route for the roofing tiles. There are no roofing tiles in here, no. Just these guys, so they're taking care of those. We were wanting to get livestock in here. Trade advanced. One, two. Okay, so that's one horse is in here now. And did we ever buy the other horse? I'm trying to remember. Did I set for two? Trade four. And we have five. Uh, okay. I don't quite know why that is, but it is. Hmm. So I could put a livestock trading post into Gimli and transfer one horse over for 20, right? Without the tariff? Maybe. Let's just put that in and make it happen. And see how that goes. So you're over here. Coins. Livestock. Rotate you up in here. Yeah, let's go across the road from you. You are... Yeah, we'll call you an end. Is this where we took off with a road? Yeah, from the trading post. We went up the hill. Okay. So you come across... There you are. You're in the shadows. I can't even see you. So you're going to be kind of in this area and set you just like that. Okay, and let's kick you up too. You're highest minus one. We want to see that this episode if we can. All right, so let's see if we can transfer that one horse over. And Gimli, 46 coins. What did we need the coins for besides being able to buy a horse at wholesale cost? Um, we needed to be able to ship out something. I guess shields. Trade, buy the route for shields. Should be 50, right? Oh, it must be March 1. And the, the infamous black box shows up that you've seen on so many other series where this, this part isn't actually working yet. Okay, royal tax is coming in. How much is it going to be? I'd say we're close to 400 by now. We've been growing since the last time I calculated. Close. 416 is what can be coming in. So we actually have 98, 96 gold, or coins to our name right now. Okay, March 1. And let me think here, you're going to cost 50 to get that route going, which should bring in some income for us. 52 just happened. Let's make that happen. So you trade, you, and scroll down and buy the route. And establish. Okay, so now these guys can officially get rid of those 50 small shields and bring in enough income to do some good for a while. All right, so they've got a bit of an income source. Um, so what was I doing? Livestock Trader's going to go in, and was that as far as I was going with that? I think it was. We're back over here with one extra horse. That's what's up. Okay. It is March, which would be a farming month if we were, uh, sowing. Um, we could delete these guys, and, yeah, we could. Let's just, I guess, one final check. So I want C and that was flax and it never returned. But it is, it is a number two green, just not a number three green. Okay. But if we do anything, we, we may barley this area and call that good. We have a lot of flax going on over here. This whole area and there were more areas, right? Over in here, over in there, yeah. So let's, I guess, just do that so that one of these days we'll get around to uh, actually doing something else with that space. All right, so nice wide open area again. And there never was a road in there. So we redo the roads later. Over here, what is happening? I guess the big thing with Samwise right now is to figure out the, the, the barter or pack station trade system between these two groups, Samwise and Gandalf. Uh, they're going to make, be making some dyes. They already have, right? Dyes 86. So we could be sending dyes over to be making cloaks or what have you. Or we could be making our own. I guess that's possible. We have a... That's just a single lot over here. 
Yeah. Uh, no, you two do not have backyards. Okay. So we'd have to jump across and head over here to do any any other artisans. Yeah. Um, these artisans did not get the chickens and goats. I left these for for artisans in case that that was the plan. Though this was supposed to be a nice productive set of fields in between. Now it just looks funny. Um, otherwise, there's nothing going on as far as farming over here. So, 12 months of food and 6 months of fuel. And 2 extra families and housing. We're at 40, we're at 48, so we should have some extra houses somewhere. Not that run, not this run. Where are you guys at? Right there. That whole area there is available for expansion. So I can't think of anything I need to be doing right at the moment. We need to check uh, need to check this. Over here on this side, I don't need to be here to check it, but it just feels right. So Gandalf, here's the Spear Militia, militia for Samwise. You guys have got 28 or 36 spears, 28 or 36 shields. In the system, we have an extra 13 spears and 63 shields. Gambesons, we have 26 extra Gambesons. 15 of you have them of the 28. So fill me in on why that is. I know that tier 3 homes can wear the higher end armor, like, I don't know if it's plate or chain or both. So does that mean they're not allowed to wear Gambesons? I would think anybody could wear the lowest level, but then they would trade it in for higher level as they progress in their status. But am I wrong? Have I just doomed these guys to going <laughs> going naked into battle because I don't have armor for them? That is, of their caliber. So fill me in on why only 15 are being used when we have 28 soldiers in this militia and we have plenty of extra gambesons. Otherwise, I guess, you know, what's the point of having the extra Gambesons other than filling in for lost troops? Uh, pull arms, Sam Wise, same thing, only six of them are wearing them. Have they just not gone to get them yet? I don't know. So there's that to think about. Um, so I've got everything I need over here. Let's see, you also have, yeah, Sam Wise has archers. One of them's wearing a Gambeson and 25 of 36 because we don't have enough peoples we have plenty of war bows we do not have plenty of war bows okay so there is one thing i was looking for i need war bows going that direction they're stocked over here let's set up war bows going that way you guys are probably down this group yeah and i want die coming back i have no idea where that is on the list I know you look like a little perfume bottle. There you are. So let's get a family in there, and you guys are up and running. Bringing dyes back, dropping off war bows. War bows over here. Pl Whoa, plenty, plenty. And we should think about getting them off into that direction. I guess soon we got to think about a whole pack system dedicated to Gimli. But Gimli doesn't have much to trade back yet. That's why I haven't bothered with it. You can't go one way with this. Unlike the trader, you can tr you can trade one direction if they have the coins. And that requires getting them the ability to sell the shields in order to get the coins. In fact, now that they've got the ability to, to sell shields, let's switch you back over and start building up our, our own uh, shields for ourselves. So it gets you guys up and running again. We needed the wooden parts in order to give them something to sell but now we have this and 11 have already left great you guys do need horses but we're waiting for this to go in it looks like we're we're at least digging the ground yeah we're working on it did this happen i've got until april to to make this a thing where am i, I know you're working on that one and you're you're in okay i'm not seeing these i'm hearing noises and i'm in the middle of a sentence and so i'm not uh I don't even see it here. Gimli, Forger's Hut. Yeah, so I miss those quite often. You need coins and planks. And it would be nice to make sure we have all that in stock. Where's our wood industry? Planks, we have a people. We have no activity here at all. This has been a pretty much a failure the entire time. What do we do about that? I think we move you two. I think you're just too far away. You're free to move, right? You are. We're too far away from homes, 
and population. I think we are. Mm. Um, I was using you to clear out here, and you've pretty much done enough. I, I'm, I'm, I'm hesitating because I don't want to have a major wood industry next to a major wood industry. I do want to separate them. This was supposed to kind of work over here while something else would work over here. I can't put them both in the same place or we will we will wipe out that forest. Hmm. So how do I get our wood industry to work? It, once I move the firewood over here, it started working great. Or once I actually I just gave them a very close place to work. Enemy units are spotted. <laughs> I think lightning just struck. Um, yeah, okay, they can, they can, they can stay in you know, frozen animation for a moment. Um, so I could set these guys' work area to right here, but still, if the family has to go this far to chop a tree, then go home, and then come back and debranch the tree, then go home, that's still a problem. This is going to be a great area for a charcoal firewood industry houses are right there and do it but I don't want to strip the forest out of two things but these houses could also and these houses here should also uh, where are they we only put the two in wait a minute where am I at over here is where I'm at okay so if I moved it to here this was supposed to supplement this yeah let's do that let's move all you guys over let's get out of this area or do we just mothball it let's just mothball it you're kind of shut down anyway. Is that... That was bad. Okay. Um, one family in just to kind of get us going again. But let's get you guys over here and make this our logging industry. And this over here would be our firewood industry. Okay. And we have houses already in place. And they live there. Good. So we already have the ability to man it. Now, where to put you? Further away. Right next to the houses. Um... We got a well over here. We have a market over here. Okay, let's see if we fit in between. You collect logs. Kind of not, but we could. We enter from there. Let's just drop you in. Do we want one more house in this area? We can house into the woods. Let's put you right back over here. I'm trying to come up with a reason for this road, even though we're not going to be using it for its intended purpose. Do we make use of that? I guess we'll put something else over here. Not sure what. Maybe the, the saw pit will be over here. Could do that. So you're going to be there. And I think as far over as I could squeeze you. And I can still get one more lot in there if I choose to. Let's road you from there to there make everything happy and we'll go with that all right am i ready to say no more is going to get done in these towns this episode uh banner raiders were seen near imminruth i don't remember which one was imminruth over near here okay uh in that case let's just pop in like so there you are. And, yep, nice save there. And you're heading like so. We're going to find more and more and more right behind them. You're coming in like this. No one's in front of them, right? You truly are the first. Oh, there we go. Boom, 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 boom. So, you are all headed at the same diagonal? You are. Okay. It's on. You're heading... Wait, where am I at? You're over here. Oh, Imminruth. I read this and upside down. I thought I was reading Imminruth. So you're all the way up in here. Okay. So in that case, and you seem to be heading for Samwise. By your angle. Let me get them coming right at me. Right about there. You are headed into Gimli. Oh. Okay. Well, I hate to do it, but you guys are probably going to be needed. I've only got 
so much gold and this is due in 127 days so beefing up Gimli's um, retinue is, is not a thing we could at least get a few in stock you know, can I? no let's see that's right over here so you guys and we don't have any kind of we have small shields and that's all we've got over here right now so Gimli is defenseless all right, so Gimli, your retinue is over here. I could grab the paintbrush and put in. I need four. I need four twenty, four thirty by the time that happens, because it the king's tax is going to grow monthly. Um, and I don't think we really gain anything by fending this off. It's not like we get loot off of them, which is really kind of not fair. We should be able to grab all of their swords and armor or whatever they've got and at least be able to sell them afterward. Um, so if I were to grab these guys at 50 per, yeah, that's two. So we have a retinue basically of six over here. Okay, now we are going to get tax money coming in. 120 days, that's four months. Three months. Okay, so three more... 10% of 8 or 900 over there. Now 7, 600. So 60. We will have 1, 2, 3, 4 in coins coming in through our own taxes. So we're at 10 now in Gimli. All right, that's a starting point. We'll, we'll go with that. You guys, I'm afraid to trigger you though. Just yet. They're coming in here. They're coming like this. Okay, I could use you to kite them, pull the semi maneuver, and bring them around and in to where the rest of our troops are stationed. I like that. Maybe let's plan the battle right next to the corpse pit. <laughs> I think that's a plan. Okay. All right, Gimli. All oh, our uh, Gandalf. All oh, you guys. You. And uh, let's leave you guys out of it for now, I think. Well, well, we'll leave it pause for a moment to give me time to think about that. Anyway, you and you. And is that the last Gandalf? I believe so. Okay. You guys all rally. You should have plenty of time to rally over here. And I don't think the fatigue counts until they get to the rally point i'd be curious to see let's pop you guys right there and we just dumped everything off into the storehouse which surprised me that first time i'd never seen that before now i get it this is what all these folks were just carrying let's pop over to samwise you and you and you and you okay and let's pop you guys into here. All right. And yeah, let's rally you guys to... Why am I seeing this? What are you? You're Samwise's archers. I thought I was over Gimli. I am. Oh, you are a merchant, aren't you? I bet you there's a merchant over here. I don't know, that, that was really odd. Like there's a Samwise citizen over here somewhere who's now running back. Or actually he just kind of phased back. That's right. They all pop out of their houses now at a full gallop. Can we see that happening? They're all flooding out of their houses. And he's even managed to find the banner. Okay. So Gimli, let's go ahead and get you going. You're right there. Let's rally you to... They're coming in like so. Let's rally you to... I want to bring you kind of through and land you where? Where's the... Over here. So if I send you... You're coming out of here. Around the forest and into there to the battle zone. Grabbing their attention at the same time. Let's do it. Alright, so you guys... We're running. There you go. You're coming out of nowhere, and while you're running, and everyone's set to run, that's right, so let's kind of grab from there to there. No, i got to do you all like that. Make sure everybody's turned off. I can't do it. 
Interesting. I can't turn it off. I gotta do you one at a time, don't I? Oh, I click the button. Oh, I hate that. Right, right click. I do use that to kind of get out of the mood I'm in, mode that I'm in, and I just reset everybody. Anyway, you guys are right there, and yeah, there's no way to test that yet. Hold on, I'll reset everyone. All right, so I've got everybody reset to where they're supposed to go after that fatal right click. <laughs> and these guys here, I think I'm going to leave you at a run. I may not even use you. We'll see. But let's get you guys over to here. About the time these guys get to... I've got to figure out where to trigger them. Let's get you guys up to here. Don't know how... How steep are you guys coming? You're like that. So I'm guessing you're headed... I guess for kind of this area. Uh, you're probably heading for the manor. That's probably your target. The very closest manor might be the plan. Anyway, you guys are, and unfortunately now I can't test it. I was wondering if, because they come out of their houses at a run, do they collect any fatigue? You are the polearm militia. Do they collect any fatigue when they're running before they have hit their rallying point? That I don't know. And by clicking accidentally right click on the ground that that shut down that order. You guys are moving quite uh, quickly. I would love to have these guys in the battle, but I don't think they're going to get there in time to do anything. And wouldn't you know it, as soon as we hit April, we'll probably get another bandit camp, and then we won't be there, and then this dude is probably going to try and claim another province, and then, <laughs> yeah, it's, it could go bad. So let's just deal with one... Uh, one battle at a time so you guys are making headway all right so what else needed to have been done during all that i was wanting to get a second tailor shop going but there's no point in that yet over here we just don't have enough wool to make it worthwhile enough yarn so that's not a thing the weavers kind of let's, let's work through this system here the malt house is up and running and we are making malt a malt the weavers are over here what was that uh livestock oh gimli yeah i want to check you out you are you don't need that many people how are we doing in that regard pop over here and leather and where is linen only seven linen so we are turning it in to stuff as fast as we can Okay, in that case, let's keep you going. Is there still enough uh, flax? Or not really. Okay, back down again. If you're going to do that, and I don't have enough uh, product available to create another tailor that is concentrating on clothes. Clo uh, linen and dye. We only have enough linen to do gambesons. Gambesons, we have 15 in stock, though. So either... They, they take a lot longer to go and collect their gamison than it does to go and collect their shield and spear. Or a bunch of them just don't qualify to wear it. I don't know which it is. So, you guys are all rolling in here. I want... You're in there, and you are... I think you started up there, so you're definitely coming down like so. You are here, and I don't know if you have triggered them or not. Let's turn off your, your run, and we'll start to... Uh, uh, start defatiguing you. <laughs> Unfatiguing. No, no, no. Right click. Rough click. Right click. Okay. I'm guessing you're triggered. I won't know because where I've got to go to is pretty much in a straight line. Let's send you guys. You are this one. Correct. That's not what I meant to do. You. Let's send you guys. Hold the control and run around like this and like that. Actually, I need you right in here. So you are going to lead them through and right up like so. That's your path. They're hopefully going to follow you. They should be at a walk. And we will be at a walk. And we'll just lead you guys in. You guys are all starting to collect down here. I want you again at a walk. Um, stand your ground and shoot at will. And I want you where? Be nice to get all the corpses into here. It really would. Let's set you like so. First volley. We'll start taking them out over there. 
these guys. Same sort of thing. And something like so. Let's go a little bit further. All right. So these two over there, I wish they would stay highlighted so I can see this. Pull arms, you're going to be back a little bit until I figure out what to do with you. Something like that. You guys are going to be the star of the show, so you're going to be out front right there. Spears, you're going to be kind of off to the side, and we'll try to be a lot wiser with how to use you this time than last time. Spears, same thing over here. Toss you. That didn't work. Or it did. There we are. So, like that. Who have I missed? Everybody's moving and into place. Nobody is not here yet. Okay. You guys are luring them. And this is what worries me. Are they following or are they not? I'm thinking they're not. So, I think you didn't grab them. Go back. And make sure to get their attention. Unless there's been some change from 972 to 975. And they just continued on their route. You guys are... You're there to there. Yep, you're right on line for right here. You are. You want to tear that manor down. Okay. Oh, oh, there you go. You just did an about face and spinning around. Yep, there you go. You found us. Okay. Now, is that all of you? They are all heading this way now. All right. So one more time. The battle's over here. You guys, let's snake you through and around like so. Hopefully that save didn't just finish things off and drop you into there. That worked. Okay. You're up and running. And, yeah, they're following correctly now. All right. So I've still got plenty of time. What else can we do this episode? Over here, we have houses to spare. You guys are over there. We are not in April yet, so we're not in the berries yet. We're in the berries. We are. Okay, so who can we shut down? Logs and timber, we're plenty of. We're not doing a lot of building right now. You're done. You're done. That's three. So right now, that's five. I want two in here. Three in there. And I want you and one, two, three. And I want one... No, I want the granary can handle their own. So, tannery. Um, hides and leather. Tannery doesn't need to be up and running. It isn't. Okay. Um, hunting is still happening, so I'll leave you alone. Where else can I steal bodies? Think, think, think. There's nobody in the, the trading post. I don't want to touch, but the, the tavern. There you are. I don't need you right now. We're not building tier threes. I want to save the rest of the ale. Okay. Malt house is running. Malt house is running, so you can keep building up. Um, I need like two more bodies. So there's nobody there. No livestock trader has been spotted. Let's. I need to go and see what's going on over there. Um, you're not actually doing anything right now, are you? You're not. Now we do have the other one, though. I don't know if I need a body in here to trade with. Let's go to Gimli real quick. And hate to keep breaking up the battle, but I. I had other plans, this one. So, you're over here. A family into here and trade in-house. I want to bring in one import, one horse. It's going to cost 30. I see. So, 30 is it no matter what. It's not a tariff thing. I think. What if I had one available? Does that change the numbers? So, let's pin you. And where am I? Where am I? Over here. You. And trade and export. In-house. Until I have four. Now we're at 20. And now we're at 20. I assume that means 20 or 30 if I go outside. So for 20, we should be able to move one horse over there. Now we're back in Gimli and we don't have it. So when that happens. So I'll leave the family in there is what I'm getting at. So I still need to find a family or two from here. And then I'm going to go back and check the battle. So family, family, family. Where do I steal you? Let's just rob the, the clay system for now. So one of you and one of you. And that fills in the voids to get two families at a time. Taking down the, here we are, taking down the berries as fast as they grow. 
All right, so that means I need to do the same thing out over here. So let me, I'll be right back. Okay, so I've gone through and got berries running everywhere. Oh, speaking of running, how did that happen? You guys got so far ad out in front of the other ones. Interesting, enemies have been spotted, yeah. And yet they're not running. Or they were running and they tired out. Okay, well, we don't have as much of a lead over there at the moment, that's for sure. But the rest are still following, and that's... Are they? You guys are kind of heading this way. You kind of are. Oh, interesting. Yeah, these guys are just embarrassing. They, they, they don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Okay, well, they're out of the battle until we take care of this first group. And then we'll, we'll, we'll go over there and inform them how it, how it works. Alright, I think we are getting ready for some excitement. There's two full militias of bows and arrows firing. Curious to see what this can do. If they're all fire at will, which means they have the better chance to aim at this point. Although, how much further dare I go before I have to run them back? That's right, set you guys to run, set you guys to run. Okay, let's go just a little bit further. They were at 18, they're still at 18. So the best we've done is just soften them up a bit. You guys, get you guys, get yourselves back to here. And do it, do it, do it. And you guys get back to here. Run through. These guys are going to head forward. They'll grab the next closest enemies to attack. And you're still... Click away. So at 18, you've shifted. You're heading after these guys. Okay, so you guys send yourselves over here. And see... Now they're back to a walk. Oh, they went running for way too long. Yeah, boom, 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 boom. You guys get another round? I have a feeling that they're... Uh, <laughs> They're not going to last long. Though we haven't taken down a single one. Interesting. All those arrows are still at 18. Anyways, you guys set for... I guess you're all stand your ground. Let's... There we go. Stand your ground. Click you. And you. Alright, that's everybody. Come on in. It's not going... Not going to last long. This guy's saying, huh, I don't think so. I No, I don't think so. All right, so that, that that's over. But we need to go chase these guys down because they really don't know what they're doing. Okay, so let me set this up and be right back. Okay, so I've got everybody moving. Um, we do have... Oh, you... Samwise Retinue. For some reason, you didn't get orders, but the Retinue is moving. That's Gimli's retinue. Where's... Are you stacked on top of each other? Yeah, there's Samwise retinue. So... I don't know what's up with you. <laughs> Let's... Well, well, I guess we're going to be one short. <laughs> I don't know what's up there. Um, this is... Gandalf. So click away. There we go. Let's put somebody in the corpse pit. Um, that's all we can spare. What's going on over here? You guys are moving. I mean, you're seriously moving. You're running. You're running into Gimli. Whoa. Okay, so let's get a Samwise retinue at a run into here. They've actually figured something out, and they, they moved in. Hmm. And what else can I do? Let's get a a group of bow and arrows. An, an archer militia, I guess, if you want to be a little more official. And get you running into here as well. Over the top. I don't know if they're going to continue. Or if they're... What was that? Enemy spotted. So this enemy is this one. The previous one is that one. Okay. So you guys are running into here. And yet before you didn't, you guys are thinking about it. Yeah, this is going to get exciting. I've not had this happen before. But the AI just messed up, didn't know what to do. They're at a full run, which means they're going to be exhausted when they get here. Goods looted. Everybody's running. Probably screaming. 
And Gimli is being ransacked. No, you stop to, to think about things. And pause here. So resources added to inventory. Log. Gimli goods looted logging camp. Resources added to inventory. I'm not sure what that means. And uh, you suddenly stopped. So what does that mean? This is all new territory for me. I just, unfortunately, I can't see you. Okay, you're yelling and screaming again. And now you're running toward, pull out, toward these guys? Unpause. Or are you just running towards your next target? Wish I could, I wish you guys would get out of the woods. There you are. So now you're running back toward the, the manor? Manor's over here. You're running toward these guys. Okay, so you guys, let's stop running and take position right there. Spread out and something along those lines. You guys quickly get right to here and stop running and fire at will. And I need somebody else. Who's the next closest? You guys, retinue, let's get you at a run and get into here to help out. Um, there until I figure out what to do with you. Okay. So you guys are running out of here. Enemy's been spotted. You're both right there. Nope, you are a traitor trying to get out of there as fast as you can. Are you one of ours? No, you're not, nothing's coming up. So you're just you're just roaming through. Yeah. All right, so you guys are in place. We're going to be attacking here soon. More added to inventory. So I'm guessing that more troops. Okay, you guys are being added to the to the uh, troops, adding to the militias as they're moving in or something like that. You're going there. You're going to stand your grounds. You guys just stop where you are. See, there was something for that. Hold. And aim. There you go. Like that. And then I need you. Unfortunately, you got to fall back or you're going to be on the front line. So let's get you... Let's rotate you around to here. Go like that, add a run. Who else is nearby? You guys. Hop in here and help out. Just like so, just to kind of back them up. And... Fatigue levels are what right now? So, you guys. Fatigue is only 16. Alright, and who's the other over here? The 24. Your fatigue is... Looks like 23%. You were running through. Okay. Who is our closest? Pull arms. You guys... Fatigue of 7... No. I can't see that. Is that 11? That's climbing and 11. There's no fatigue. Run you into here. Into here. Because they're going to be chasing these guys around, I would imagine. You guys, get over there. Get moving. There you go. Come on around. These guys are going to follow, but they're going to hit these guys first. Boom, 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 boom. And you stopped. All right. So pull away and I want to see something. You are stand your ground and you're good. Okay. You're coming in like that. You guys don't know what you're doing. You guys are helping out. We're at 24. We want to be at 24 when we're done. You guys help out. Hop in there. Great. Arrows are coming in. Perfect. Now what else can I do to help you? All right. So you are on your way in. Let's get you guys now at a run and you can come in like so and who else is left you guys had a run come in like so we still have one more group out here somewhere I think they're in the woods by now so we don't know where they're coming in and I want more arrows you guys do not have arrow, uh, orders yet you come in and I guess set yourselves up kind of over here we've got one more group coming so who else left that can help with that group you guys and at a run come over and guard those archers all right Let's see how this lines up. Pull away. Enemy spotted. Uh, pull out. You're over here. Whoa, you're closer than I thought you were. Okay, pause and rethink you. You guys, again, it doesn't tell me where I aimed them at, but you're going to go right here now. And just like that, and you guys are going to be right there and firing like crazy. Run in and do your thing. You guys are all what you should be. I want to see what's going on over here. 
So over here, who and what? We're down to 21 and 10. And enemies are pretty much surrounded and done. Enemies are over here. And pull arms are on their way. You guys are bows. You guys are pull arms. And I want you guys to help out at this end. So drop you right into there. And the 10. Where are the 10 versus the 21? So you guys are there. Let's just drop you in right here. Right now. Do that. Pull away. The 24, 21 are okay. They're going to take out these. Oh, they've already broken. I didn't catch that. Yeah. So now we're all taking out these guys. All right. We're 21 and 10. I think we're going to be fine there. Somebody else just broke too. Where's the other group? We're over here. I think this is all that's left. Boom, 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 boom. You are... You're running. You guys... Can I just click in there? I think so. Did you break? No, you, you changed your mind. Okay. You guys are still firing at will. Right? Did I ever set you for that? I did. Shoot at will. Okay. You are attacking where arrows... All oh, those look like flaming arrows. They're not, but they sure look like it. Okay, you're coming in. You guys are attacking. You guys don't know who your enemy is. You're doing a lot of cheerleading, I guess. And our 36 is still 36. You're done. Influence gained. And we are done here. I think we're raw, raw, rawing over here. Something like that. I think we're done. I think so. You guys... They're fleeing. I think we're done. You guys are going to get a few extra bows. Yeah, oh, we did take one down. And we're shooting them in the back. Any more shots? Any more shots? No. Okay. <laughs> All right. So we showed them what for. <laughs> it. They did attack this, which wasn't built yet, which is interesting. So I think that means they stole a log that had been brought over to the logging camp. They came in from there. They didn't get to this logging camp. So they didn't really loot that. When it says looted logging camp. Enemies spotted. Goods looted logging camp. Yeah, they didn't make it over to this side. Otherwise, what? We did not get a bonus of gold. We did get a huge bonus of influence, though. Which means we could pretty much shut down all influence peddling as far as tithing goes. for Just for the sake of tithing. Because we've got enough now, influence-wise, to take out all of the other provinces as far as 2,000 points per. And just quickly while I'm thinking of it, take you guys down and take you guys up. Unfortunately, we need taxes bad if we're going to hit that 416 in time. So you guys are up and over here. Let's take you down. And do I go to 15% for a month or two? I think I do. Let's write you in. 15 and that should 15% of, yeah, of a smaller number. That's going to hurt here. It is. But I think it's what we're going to have to do for a bit. Otherwise, I think, I have no idea how long this episode is, so I think I am done. And we'll just kind of, I'll leave it right there. We'll clean up the mess next time. Probably in between episodes, I'll send them all home. And we'll I'll be back for April and we'll make sure the berry picking is actually working. So thanks for watching folks. That was fun and catch you later. Bye-bye now.